Well, hi there, this is Chase, and I'm going to show you in this video, well, you probably just did a search for how do I make my website appear first on Google. That's a $10,000 question, if there's ever a, a good question, but uh, let me turn it a little bit, and let me show you what I'm, how to do it, okay? So, what I'm going to do a search on right now is... I'm going to show you how I've gotten on the first page of Google. And there were a lot of searches there that I could have chosen, but I've done it a number of times, okay? So my website for this search, how to remove spyware from Mac, my website is on the first page of this Google uh, result, right? And you're looking at it right here. It's the number two link, which is YouTube. And you're like, no, 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 no. I didn't ask how to get YouTube. I asked how to get my website to appear first on Google. And I'm like, yes, I know. Look at right here. As you, as you see in the description of my video, that's my website. I'm the number two link on Google for this search. Okay. So the key and, and getting your website on the first page of Google, getting it to appear first is really hard. But getting a video from YouTube on the first page of Google is quite easy. Now, not a guarantee. Not all of my videos all get on the first page of Google, Google but many do. And when I say many, probably 20% of the videos I do, which is awesome. And if you look at this video, and you can do the search, you can pause this video. Uh, that you're watching and do a search for how to remove spyware from Mac. In fact, I'll put that in the description of this video so you can just uh, copy the uh, phrase. But if you look at this, let's click on this link. We're going, we're going to um, my video and I've gotten uh, 36,000 views. So that doesn't just happen randomly. It doesn't happen because I told a few friends and it's not a viral it's not a viral type video. You're not going to get really excited about it. But if you're searching for how to remove spyware from Mac, it's pretty darn awesome. And then what's really cool is you can uh, share information of what they're looking for. And if you see, I have information about how to remove spyware from Mac, such and such, you know, step by step. But I also showed in the video. Of course. Now, this is an ad, by the way. Uh, my video is actually uh, coming up uh, after the ad. So, uh, but there's my website. It's inside the description. That's how you get, that's, let me, let me rephrase this. This is how the easiest way you can get your website appear first on Google without a whole lot of work because Google owns YouTube. And so when you do a search, a lot of times YouTube is up here. Why? Because they have ads around that. They have ads around. They don't. Amazingly, there are not many ads on this page right here. But Google makes their income, their money from ads surrounding searches. OK, so my point is you can get your website on the first page of Google by putting together a video. Now your can, video can be on all sorts of topics, but it's best if it relates to your website, right? Um, so, you know, here's what you do. You go to Google and you type in uh, a phrase re relative to your interest and to your website, or it could be or to your website. It doesn't, it's something interesting that you know that you could talk about. I'm going to type in bananas, okay, banana, how do you say bananas, and then I'm, I'm just waiting, and what you see uh, are some suggestions, and so this is how you're going to get your website on, your website to appear first on Google, is by doing a YouTube video. Uh, I don't even know what bananas Grand Junction is, but on bananas foster, I think, is a uh, kind of like a uh, item you go order in the uh, restaurant. Uh, let's try bananas in pajamas. I have no idea what that really means, but it must be a song because as soon as I click on that and then hit a space afterwards, then it gives me this awesome suggestion. Okay, bananas. What I'm looking for, by the way, is a longer keyword phrase. Your videos that you do on YouTube, it's easier to rank 
on the first page of Google if you have a long keyword phrase. So this is one, two, three, four. So um, these are all four. Um, let's just try costume, and then I'm gonna hit a space. <clears throat> now looking at it, so you see a eBay for adults. Ah, so, um, so if you type F-O-R, you're gonna get for adults. What I'm doing is using Google to extend my keywords. So bananas and pajamas costume for adults, for babies, for sale. And bananas and pajamas spelled a little bit differently for sale. Now, what's the longest one? Uh, probably for babies or adults. Okay, so I'll just go with adults. Now I'll go up and I'll hit space bar or the space right after. And there's really nothing longer. Okay, but that's a pretty good phrase. So can I guarantee it? No, I can't, but I'm going to do some further research. Okay. So I take this keyword phrase. Now you would pick your topic. You would do just what I've done, but I picked the bananas just out of the blue. And now if your website related to fruit or selling things or whatever, or whatever, you could use this and then put your website in the description of the video. But we're not done yet. I've copied that. The next thing I want to do is open up another tab. And I want to find out how many people search on that keyword phrase. So I'm going to the Google Keyword Planner. You can sign up for this for free. You have to set up a campaign, but you can immediately delete it. Delete it. Setting up a ca campaign means setting up an ad, okay? But you can delete it, and then you can use this tool, which is the Google AdWords Keyword Planner. It'll tell you how many people search for this, because I want to do a video that gets searched on. Okay, so if I paste in bananas, I have no idea. So let's click on get ideas. So bananas in pajamas costume for adults. And it's coming up, it's loading. Okay. Okay, 10 people. It's a little low, but I would still do the video. Well, actually there's one more thing. So 10 people, and let me zoom in on that. That's how many searches. Don't worry about the competition. This is AdWords, that's different. It's not, there's no competition, probably. Um, so 10 people a month, I would do the video. I've seen searches like 300 and, and, and such. In fact, if I go back to remove, uh, how to remove spyware from Mac, if I go to my, uh, key, to the keyword planner and do a get ideas on that, look at that, 320 people search a month. That's a fantastic number. Okay. But if I just go back to, uh, the bananas, okay. For adults. Uh, I'm guaranteed that 10 people, it's a start, okay? It's a start. You'll find other keyword phrases that are much higher, which is awesome. Probably not going to get 10,000. You're probably going to get upwards of 700, maybe. Not many more, because it's a longer keyword phrase. Now, we're not done. We've got to find out if there's any competition on YouTube. So, I just go to YouTube. Okay, this is the process. You haven't figured out whether you're going to do it yet. And you paste in the keyword phrase with double quotes. Do you see how I put a double quote around? It asks YouTube, hey, how many videos have this as the main focus of the topic? Okay. And you just put around double quotes. Okay, zero. I would absolutely do this video. Because it's very, 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 very likely you'll be the number one video for that keyword phrase. And then, as I showed you... You can go into the video. I'm just gonna pause it here. Oops, sorry. And so what, what you do is, um, the first thing you do in the description, and you can learn more about this if you need to on YouTube. I may have a video on how to do that, but in the description, the first thing you do is put your website, and then you put the keyword phrase, okay? And then you share some information about how to do or what the answer is to the question. So I did that, and then I went to um, some information about my website. That's how I got it, number one on the YouTube search, okay, or on Google search. So if I go back again, you know, I'm pretty happy. I'm very happy, and it'll change your business too, to do it the easy way, to do a YouTube video. And you'll know this is a screen recording. I, I didn't have a webcam on, although you can. Many people don't have a problem doing a video and sharing their heart, sharing their opinion, sharing their ideas about the topic that you do the search on. 
And then you'll uh, also want to put the keyword phrase um, in the, and I didn't do a great job, but um, I should have said how to remove instead of protect. Uh, but it still, it still worked. And then also in the tags, which is in the description of the video. So I don't really have time to cover all of this. This was just a, uh, a beginning, but you found, you know, we started with bananas in pajamas. I typed in bananas and Google told me all of this. It told me what people are searching for. And then we went to the keyword planner and it told me that again, 10 people a month search for this. But guess what? In October, it's it's a lot more. Okay, so you could have a video that just kills it in October because that's Halloween, of course. And then we found out that YouTube, <laughs> there's zero results. Okay, nobody's done a video on that topic yet. There are searches for that. And so if you want to look at the people that are already, you know, the videos that will come up because YouTube will list something. So banana, fancy dress, um, is close, but it's not bananas in pajamas, costume for adults. If you had some knowledge about that topic, you could do a video and that would appear very, very likely appear here because the strong, the keyword phrase is in the title and that's what YouTube is just a search engine and it's looking for, oh, that's what you typed in. Well, let me see what I can find. And it goes off the title. That's the blue area right there. It also goes in the description. So I would put first, put your website right there so that people can click it. And um, here's somebody that put bananas and pajamas costumes in the title and in the um, description. But they may not have it in the tags. And you can just add a little more information to make it to make YouTube realize, oh, this is what your video is all about. So the idea is you can do it on any topic. You just go to Google and type in um, truck for kids, you know, and maybe that's not going to come up with much. Okay, it doesn't. I'm just trying to guess at something. Truck for kid video. Um, I'm just trying to think of something and then keep going on and add a space. Not much is appearing here. So, um, Try this, best dog for, okay, boom, for search and rescue. Oh, do you have some knowledge about that? Um, put a space there and you get these options, but maybe there's something, best dog for hiking, so type in an H, okay, best dog for home protection, best dog for hot weather. These are all H related and hunting. Uh, for hiking, home protection, let's try this one. And then I'll put a space after the N. Okay. Look at this. Best dog for home protection in India. Best dog for home and personal protection. I'm guessing a lot more people do it. Search there. I'm going to grab that keyword phrase. The whole thing. I'm going to paste it into the Google AdWords keyword planner. This is Google's data. It'll tell you all the information. Best dog for home and personal. Okay. 10 again. A little bit low, but wouldn't you love to be on the first page of Google for, with your website, on a YouTube video? Of course you would. And then the ultimate is, do you do the video? Well, you have to do a double quote, paste, double quote, hit enter. Okay, there's one result. These two are ads. Somebody else has some keywords in there, but you're going to kill it. Well, you're going to do better, I should say. Uh, because you're going to have a video that is all about the best dog for home and personal protection. And you'll put that in the keyword, uh, in the title, in the description, like in this area, and in the tags. If you don't know about title and description and tags, do a little more searching on YouTube and you'll find it. I just wanted to give you a real quick how-to on how do you make your website appear first on Google. And the way to do it is to do a video on YouTube because then you can get your your web page listed there. People will watch the video and they go, oh, look at this. And they click on your link. Not 100%, but a certain percent will. It's the easiest way to make your website appear first on Google. This is Chase Whip. Hope you enjoyed this. Give me a like if you did and a positive comment on, well this, on how this helped you. Have a great day. Bye for now.